Hello and welcome to American Truck Simulator with me, Kevin Sawyer. And you join me here in uh, Carson City and I've picked up a job of some electrical goods. And uh, the plan is to uh, pay off, try and pay off the bank loan, um, expand the business a bit further. So, um, but anyway, I'll show you what's been going on truck management wise, uh, driver wise sorry I should say uh, company manager driver manager so Anna, Anna's growing up quite well she's 2.5 now and um, Ben is 1.7 but anyway let's get on the road hope you guys are all well and I hear you all shouting yeah Kev we're good How's you? I'm good, very much. Thank you very much for asking. Um, I've kind of played about with the um, camera, as you can see, uh, or the mounting of the camera, so you can see a bit more of the display for you guys to uh, sort of like get a better idea of the. Hopefully, you can see this uh, the taco a bit better now. It's not great, but it's probably as good as it's going to get now without it getting too much in my way but anyway I digress let's get on the road and away so put the side lights on Got some more wipers on as well it's raining for us first time not had rain for a while it's still a bit jittery as well guys so again can only apologize about that's why I'm in still in automatic And you guys might be asking, why aren't you running the um, Arizona Beta? Um, um, reason is because of my mods. Um, I want to let the uh, official DLC come DLC come out and um, the mods to catch up. Otherwise, I'm going to be in a quandary before I even know it. Um, just bring up the sat nav. There we go. You've got to try and remember that the camera's there and not knock it because it's kind of relocated it now. So thirty along here, yeah. yeah. Um, as for aspects for computer upgrade, still ongoing. <laughs> Again, sorry guys. Um, this money, getting the money together to do it. Life keeps on getting in the way. Um, it's not cheap exercise. My brother has sent me some lists for some cheaper parts. But again, with other commitments, can't just jump in. It makes my life a little bit easier. Um, That's uh, you know the next game plan. This is like I saw the SKRS shifter and I was re I really want it. I do really want it. Um, but that's the that's the focus plan at the moment. Is uh, get the uh, computer upgraded first of all. Red means stop, Mr. Sawyer. Oh, green means go as well. Alright, on the way we go. It's Mr. Buzzkill, just waiting to find me, I can see it. Is that the rain finished with? Is that a quick. Shower then. Yeah, so the next plan is um, with truck aspects. Um, I'm probably going to buy the mod um, Volvo. I've done some jobs off screen, offline, offline, off screen, um, and uh, it's not bad truck actually. 
Um, it's quite good, lots of customization on it. Um, but it's quite expensive, the customization I want. So um, I think the next plan is to sort of try and get the get out the bank's pocket again before uh, thinking about doing that. So I'll do one or two recorded episodes of this on this truck and then depending on how far we get um, is dependent on how quick I can pay off that loan. I don't know, I'm still well in an R because it's like a hundred thousand to upgrade the shop. So and then it's gonna be about roughly about two hundred thousand for the to like truck. So it's a choice to pay off the bank, get out of their po pocket, or uh, spend all the money we've earned on uh, up, uh, getting a new truck, upgrading the garage, etc., etc., yada yada. I know if I've got another driver on board, I'll probably probably get better experience, um, or better cash flow coming in. Um, though, you know, they're low level drivers I've got at the moment, so. I think I'm soon to upgrade as well, so I probably already have done, I've not even noticed it. But I'm glad you're all enjoying this um, Sim Dash set I've got up now. I enjoy having it back. To be, be honest, it's you know, it helps me. I can look down at the gauges rather than try and squint at the screen. It's like, well, why don't you just get Track IO? You can zoom in and out because uh, that's expensive, and it tends to only work really well if you've got like a free monitor set up. Or You can adjust, I've been told, you can adjust the tilt so you don't have to tilt your head so much to um, rotate the camera all the way, but I still think it lends itself better to three monitor setup or at least two monitor setup. I know it's 70 along here, but it tends to rev quite high if we uh, go above 60. So I'll leave it at. 60 Whoops, drifting again Speed. Oh no, I'm speeding. For a change, I'm not speeding. Makes a nice change. Me and my big mouth are going to shoot myself in the foot now. I think coming, I hope. So I've got to watch it. Watch what I'm doing. Don't change on me lights, don't change on me lights, don't change on me lights. Thank you.
off the uh, side of the road there, Kev. Might help. Stretch their legs a little bit. Could do with some more fuel, I guess. Get some in the next one. I think we got enough in there for a little while. Could live, could live to regret that. Um, so, everyone keeping their eye out on the old fuel gauge if it starts to throw up about there. And the uh, fuel warning lights around about there. So, if that starts flashing, normally it has to get right to the red before it gets to that. Be a first what first see me almost running out of fuel. If it gets to that point in the episode, I'll uh, name the episode "Running on Fumes." See, there's another fuel station, I believe, coming up. Was that a way station? Could be a way station. No, it's a fuel station. Let's gamble. Let's gamble. Let's hope there's another one up the road a bit. Mind you, I'm not doing myself any favours by revving it high either. It's 80, might as well. I'm well, just gonna drink. It's gonna drink the old diesel now. Come on, Mr. Range Rover. Five along here, is it? All right, so remember that. That's probably because of that junction, I guess. that truck I know. Try and give him as much space as I can. I think we need to turn off as well. Hope he's out of my Thank you. I'll talk to him in a minute after I've done my episode. I think he's uh, asking me if he wants to do a recording together. Possibly. I don't know if he's got. He might have. ATS. I don't know if he's got ATS and if he can play multiplayer on it. Mind you, it might not support my mods, it's in the downside. Whoa, that was close, Kev. That was close. Dead was close. 
and I'm speeding. Yep. Ah, oh, Mr. Buzzkill. Okay, it was my fault. I was speeding. Another hopping fine to add to the collection of fines. Ooh. He was sort of committed, I was sort of committed. Going Pete Tong straight away. Uh, so 65 back along here. As you're laughing your heads off. I think I'll keep it around about 60 just to be on the safe side. Won't rev the engine so much then. I can learn not to drift the truck. Keep lane discipline at least. Keeping a close on that fuel level. It's not going down as quick as I thought it was going to. I don't know if I'm uh, going to risk passing another one or not. Just don't think this thing's got enough fuel in it to go that distance. Ooh. Come on guys, it's 80 along here. I'm only going to do 60 though. No, you should really keep it under 50 if you want to try and save fuel. Um, but I don't know if it really matters on these big rigs. I mean, they just drink it no matter what. How many miles have we got left on our journey? Well, not many. I think we could probably make make the job without even refilling to be honest. It says I'm running low on fuel but there's a gas station down there but I'll continue on because it's not coming up as red on my uh, on my dashboard or the game's dashboard so So I'll wait until it either comes up red on that, or well, really start to worry. Oh, speeding. Okay, it's the buzzkill. It's 55 then. It's two, two for one speeding fines today, obviously. Two for one speeding fines. Oops.
finished up something again. I think it's running out of fuel yet again. It's like, you must find fuel soon. <laughs> find fuel. Running on fumes. Not to my gauge, you're not. you still got... Well, you are. I will start to worry if that light comes on. See if the light comes on. She's normally just under that um, upper red bar on my sim dash. It starts to flag up. I think the job's going to be complete before I even run out of fuel anyway. So I can see it on my GPS. So. lights on I guess. It's getting a bit dark. See there's no real need to worry. Okay we are low on fuel admittedly but come on old girl. Sneak round him without too many issues. Yeah, I think I can. Right. This concludes the journey. Uh, let's play it safe, please. As we're like running low on fuel. It's like excuses, excuses, because you just you're a coward, big coward. Yeah, not far off the bat there. Wouldn't stand there, mate. I really wouldn't. Yeah, the advanced trailer hitch does look good. I'm gonna have to try and get into the habit of actually reversing properly into the onto the trailers now, just to get ready for that. I know the mod trucks can't take them though. You have to use the stock ones and stock. Don't know about trailers. Right. Okay. Detaching trailer. Cool. Uh, how are we doing for time? Oh, done the job quicker than I thought for. So let's go see if we can see if we can actually find a fuel station now. <laughs> Where's the closest one? Um, probably turns out we're right on top of one. Uh, we are here, and we are right on top of one. Right, cool. Let's uh, drive down there then. And I'll call it an episode. Whoopsie. Sorry, not the camera then. Right, um around the side here, isn't it? 
amazing how she's fixated just to the road. It's like, stares blankly into space. Right, it's up to the right here, isn't it? Easy, Kev. You need to turn here. I think it's up here. Better turn some lights on as well. Before I get done, if I have no lights on. That'll be the next thing. No light charge! I know you still an ETS, but I don't know about ATS. If it's gonna go, it's gonna go soon. Take her out of gear. Reset the trip monitor. And enter. Cool. I think I'll leave it at that, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please don't forget to uh, like. And if you're new to my channel and want to see future episodes of this and anything else that I'm working on, please don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. TTFN.